All right. Hey, I wanted to jump on a quick episode to talk about how to close more loans with your 90 day old leads. Uh, I'm your host, Steve Kyles. Thanks for joining us on the Loan Officer Leadership Podcast powered by the Mortgage Marketing Animals. And hey, this uh, theme over the next several months is conversion. How do you close even more of the loans you already have without getting um, without doing another cold call, but really nurturing, really being a steward, really focusing very intently on the business you've already got. And so let me just share a quick strategy. I think it'll help you uh, close even more loans with the leads you've already got. So we talked about it today in the Loan Officer Breakfast Club. And man, I just think it's too good not to share with our Loan Officer Leadership podcast audience. Uh, so here's what we want to do is there was a massive study. Carl was talking about it this morning, and it was talking about converting leads. And, and even with things like Zillow leads and consumer direct leads and, hey, when do they really convert? And the study found that about 15% of leads convert within the first 90 days. 85% of those leads actually converted after 90 days. And what's interesting is, is you got all these people going after leads and I'm not a huge advocate of Zillow or consumer direct leads, but it, it tells the story of what happens is somebody gets in the market, they express interest, then they slow down and it takes them about 90 days to get reacclimated, informed and excited about buying. And so one of the things that we want to do, um, especially in this season, is we're going to make our own markets. We're going to be the ones who walk through and participate in our own rescue. And so in doing that, my challenge to you is this, let's go after the 90-day-old or greater leads. So I'd look at leads that have closed, or not leads that closed, but leads that came in 90 days or older. And heck, I'd go back at least um, year to date and possibly even the year before. And let's go after them. And with a real simple thing, we're going to send them uh, the nine word text. And here's what you're going to do. So uh, I would not send it if you've got, you know, 200 leads or 300 or 400, whatever the number is, I wouldn't send them all out at once. I'd do them in batches of 50. And here's all we're wanting to do. Let's see if they, we can get some interest waking up in the people that are older leads that didn't convert. They didn't take a next step. They've kind of fallen off. So send out this text. Are you still looking to buy a home in, insert in your state, like Texas, in Utah, in Virginia, in Florida, are you still looking to buy a home in Texas? And then hyphen Steve Kyles. And what we found was when we A-B tested it, as we added more words, our conversion actually went down. So literally, that's it. Uh, if you're looking to do something to wake up the leads that have come in 90 days or older, I, um, I think it's a huge way to get people that were interested but not motivated who now are getting into the motivated stage that oftentimes we forget because we're focused on other things go after our 90 day plus older leads at least year to date i would challenge you go back into last year and even if you wanted to go crazy and go the year before do it uh, but here's what i would do for your purchases are you still looking to buy a home in insert in texas state the state that you're in and then hyphen Steve Kyle's hyphen your name. Uh, and that's what we're going to do. We're going to send it out in batches of 50. Those 50 are going to go out as they start coming back in, uh, respond to them, communicate with them, get them warmed back up. And then we always touch the lead, touch the partner. So whoever they originally came from, it came from an agent, a client's waking back up. Let's get the agent involved. And now we've created activity, not by making a cold call, but actually by making calls and following up with the people that came in earlier this year, late last year, middle of last year. And it's a phenomenal way to shake the tree, be proactive in our marketing efforts without making a cold call. Then I'd do the same thing for refis. Anybody who's touched a refi expressed interest in the last year, two years, are you still looking to refinance your home in Texas, Steve Kyles? And what you're doing is, let's put it out there, it's a high-tech, low-time, high touch way to touch a lot of leads in a short amount of time to wake up the business and see what it is you can do to get more loans in the pipeline. I hope this helps. Hey, um, if you're looking to get help and you say, Steve, I need help with a plan, what else can I do? Uh, this is one of just so many uh, tools and strategies we have right now that are helping our loan officers 
our loan officers in the Freedom Club over the last four months have averaged an increase of over 22.9% in their business. When other people say the sky's falling, it's not working, uh, we're seeing an increase with our Freedom Club members because they're following strategies just like this, not making another cold call, but simply putting a same way every time process in place to go get even more. Go to Freedom planningcall.com freedomplanningcall.com we'd love to help you uh, close even more business this month next month and the next month freedomplanningcall.com i hope this quick tip helps you go get more business know this you're participating in your own rescue you're making your own way and you've got what it takes so go out there and do it if you need help go to freedomplanningcall.com anything worth doing is worth doing badly just get started see ya 